macrocytogenics, an important inhibition of mitochondrial complex 1. The history of acetogenics. Anonases acetogenics are secondary metabolites, which are found in the plant family Anonasia. More than 500 have been isolated. The extracted polychemicals have very potent and diverse effects on cellular respiration. Data of previous research has shown that acetogenins have anti-tumor, anti-malarial, and pesticidal properties. Recent studies in cancer research have been performed using isolates of acetogenins from the soursop fruit, which is shown to the figure to the right. Stereochemistry of the acetogenin consists of four major factors. Those four factors are an alpha beta unsaturated gamma lactone ring, one to three tetrahydrofuran or THF rings with flanking OH groups, as you can see right here, a long apple tail, which comes off the end of the THF core, and the alpha spaces between the two major chemical cores, which are the gamma lactone and the THL4. To the right, you will see different variations of the lactone ring. You will also notice that there are different variations of the THF ring. These THF rings consist of mono, non-adjacent bis containing two TH rings, and the adjacent bis THF ring, which face the same direction. Altogether, this gives Acetogenic great structural variation, making it a very diverse molecule. When focusing on a eukaryotic cell, as shown to the figure to the right, we notice that it has various organelles, consisting of an endoplasmic reticulum, a nucleus, cytoplasm, cytoskeleton, ribosome, Golgi body, a lysosome, and a mitochondria. The mitochondria is an organelle found in large numbers in most eukaryotic cells. It is used for energy production. The mitochondria is an organelle in the inner membrane consisting of folds, which helps to create what we call cristae. This inner membrane of the mitochondria is what holds the complex one which is a protein which assists in the creation of energy within the mitochondria. The inner membrane is where the citric acid cycle takes place, producing electrons that travel to the different protein complexes. Acetogenic interacts with complex one. Complex one is this figure right here. As you can see, it is also known as the NADH ubiquinone oxidoreductase. Complex 1 is essential to energy production within the, mit in the mitochondria, which also helps with the cell. Complex 1 extracts energy from NADH. The potential difference is used to power the synthesis of ATP. It traps in the energy and a potential difference or voltage across the mitochondria into membrane. The potential difference powers ATP synthesis or the production of energy. As you can see, the crucial structure factors of the acetogenins are ambiguous, suggesting that when it attaches to complex one, the enzyme recognizes each of the multiple functional groups of the inhibitor nucleus. Previously investigating the inhibiting effect on human cancer cell lines, researchers Kazuma synthesized Three, C35 million is on the analog. The C35 fluoro, the C35 difluoro, and the C35 trifluorosomal. Focusing on the significance of the methyl group of the gamma lactone ring and using a mono THF ring, Kojima replaced the hydrogen atoms of the methyl group with both the fluorine. This was to see if the complex would still recognize the gamma lactone, even if the methyl group was altered. Results showed as the methyl group was present, there was a greater, greater cellular inhibition 
on cancer cell growth. But when a fluorine replaced a hydrogen molecule, uh, a hydrogen atom, there was less cellular cancer cell inhibition. And as you can see, cell growth goes up. When there were two fluorine atoms replacing two hydrogen atoms, there was an even greater number of cell growth in cancer cells. And with three, as we can see, it doubled 10 times more. Results show a decrease in cell growth activity. Nevertheless, research Miyoshi noted that there was also a decrease in cell inhibition as the number of fluorines increased. It remained inconclusive in whether the decrease in inhibitory activity was caused by the replacement of fluorine atoms with hydrogen or vice versa, hydrogen atoms by fluorine atoms, or was it because of the metabolic difference in stability? Miyoshi decided to focus more on stereochemistry of the acetogen, where Kojima focused more on the cancer cell growth and the methyl groups. Miyoshi cautioned if inhibition was due to the replacement of hydrogen with fluorine. It was probably due to fluorine having a higher electronegativity and fluorine being a larger atom than the hydrogen atom. This will create a bulkier, stereo, a bulkier stereochemistry on the acetogen molecule. Also, it would disturb the intermolecular interactions of the gamma lactone ring with the acetogen fluorine molecules. So, after evaluating Kojima's work, Miyoshi noted that the gamma lactone moiety is strictly recognized by comment one and plays a crucial role in inhibition. Miyoshi referenced back to his previous work, where he created a delta lac by deletion of a gamma lac ring. As you can see, this is the gamma lactone. He deleted that, and he focused on inhibition from there. It is noted that synthetically produced delta lac acetogen elicited just as strong as the inhibitory response and inhibitory effect on complex one as natural acetogenesis. In contrast, the deletion of a big THF, which is one of the THF rings here, derivatives result in a decrease in inhibitory activity. Initially, he concluded that the enzyme was not recognized strictly by the complex one. However, after going back and examining Kojima's work, he noticed that due to the different variations in structural factors, by using a bis thf a mono-THF, and a lac acetogenin, it was complicated to really compare the two studies. To overcome this discrepancy, it would be a better idea to use a mono-THF instead of a bis thf as the control. As a, re as a result to all of this, Miyoshi had to reject his initial hypothesis. Altogether, both Miyoshi and Kojima came to an agreement. It indicates that the gamma lactone moiety, which binds to the region of complex one, is strictly recognized by the enzyme, thus making it a critical and important structural factor in the inhibition of natural acetogen. This is complex one. More research is still needed to fully understand the effectiveness of acetogenic, stereochemistry, and recognition in complex one. And this concludes my presentation. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Do you have any questions?